It's good morning. She's not liking that. Today we decided to go to the Gulf Islands. We are currently on a ferry and it's about half an hour commute. Got here half an hour prior to departure, which is at seven in the morning. All the ferries going to Vancouver are pretty much almost full. We want to go to the Gulf Islands. You don't have to line up too early. Okay, we have a bunch of activities planned. We want to go to, what was that cheese place called? Salt Spring Cheese. Salt Spring Cheese Factory. There's a cute treehouse restaurant on the island as well. Um, has really good reviews. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and we're gonna go to Ruckel <laughs> Provincial Park when we get there because the restaurant doesn't open till <laughs> in the morning. Macy is not having it. But she's gonna have fun! Say hi. Hello, hello. It's your girl, not to lay, also known as Scotty Doe. And I decided I would do a voiceover, switch things up a bit because I don't really talk that much in my vlogs. I am not a very eloquent speaker, but I will try my best. Um, I'm just going with the flow. This is me magically at the Treehouse Cafe. <laughs> Being a tourist, Matt's reflection, featuring him. This little sneak peek inside the restaurant. I ended up getting the huevos rancheros. It was delicious, a little bit pricey, but that's okay. They provide blankets. Treehouse in the middle, restaurant surrounding, really cute tight-knit restaurant. There's the eggs, beans, Salsa, potatoes, and a little bit of a parsley garnish for you. I got a matcha latte. I love my matcha. Love, love, love. This breakfast got me stuffed. It was good. After we ate our breakfast, we are heading to the first market of the season. Very exciting. Oh my gosh, this chili oil. Let's buy this. I think they're a Japanese couple. I'm not too sure. But oh my gosh, that sample was delicious. We did get one jar. We found the Salt Spring Island goat cheese as well. So we got that. And they were having a block sale at this local store. I did a little bit of not that much damage. I got a really good sale on jacket. And then got some gelato. That was amazing. It, oh, 10 out of 10. So yeah, we end up going to Harlan's Gelato. And we got the Dolce Latte and the Strawberry Mint. Can't wait to go it again. I'm just cleaning Mimi's paws because she is the little princess that she is. And we wanna make sure that she is clean before I put her on my lap. And she's honestly my best friend. I do love going to cafes, as you know. If you didn't watch my last vlog, watch it. We went to Francis Bread. They had, it looked like they had some really good bomb ass sandwiches that they were offering, but we had already eaten, so I was pretty full. Lemon eclair, pistachio something, and a cheese croissant. And they had a lot of cute shops in the area, local cheese, crackers, kombucha, all that good stuff. Oh, 
and the baked goods. Mm. They left some free samples, so I did try some of the local jams and jelly. And of course, I'm at a coffee shop, so we went to the Salt Spring Coffee. I just got a regular coffee. After all this, we went to the provincial park to do a little bit of hiking with our little Mimi. So she can get some exercise, as you know. We did end up going to the Salt Spring Island Farm Shop after because we saw that they had really good ratings for their cheese. So we saw the little goats at the farm and then we got a margarita pizza because all the other pizzas that I wanted to try were sold out, which was unfortunate. But next time, next time, I did get some more samples of the actual shop, which was delicious. Hopefully next time I can try their truffle pizza. I think the girls that were beside us had the last one and I overheard that it was a very strong truffle flavor, but I'm all about that. I love me some mushrooms. So we did get that to go and we ate that in the car while we were on the ferry heading home and it was delicious. But I wish we got two pizzas. It's all good. We'll just go there next time. Maybe they'll have the truffle mushroom pizza. All right, I think, yeah, that was pretty much it for our little half day salt spring adventure. What I love about being on the island in BC is being surrounded by the lush greenery and it's honestly the weather that I do love. And they have a bunch of gardens on the island here, which I don't have a green thumb, but I appreciate the art of gardening and the patience and the hard work. I applaud all of you who garden and hopefully in the future I will get a garden but knowing my lazy butt, I'm probably just gonna get an indoor hydroponics garden. Okay, you guys, if you didn't see my last vlog, I went cafe hopping, mini egg hunts around Victoria. And it was so much fun just creating content for that. I am such a foodie, and sometimes I will spend literally hours trying to find cute cafes. And I honestly have such a long list. I saved so many posts on Instagram um, on where to go in Vancouver. You guys, the food scene there is quite great. And I didn't show a clip of me eating the ice cream cake from 49 Below Ice Cream. You guys, it's delicious. And I'm all about the Oreo cookie crumb. It's so good. Highly recommend. Also, I love The Walking Dead. And we finished the most, I guess it's like the spinoff from The Walking Dead with just two of the main characters. I don't want to spoil anything, but you guys. If you haven't, you must watch The Walking Dead, The Ones Who Live. And I just love a good storyline that just tugs at your heart. It's very cathartic. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. 